Hi! In this video, I'll show you how to program a simple MyBlock for turn in place to a desired angle for EV3 robots using the gyro sensor. We have another video on our channel that describes a more sophisticated turn in place MyBlock that uses acceleration and PID control. But the turn in place I'll show you should be good enough for most first LEGO League teams. Turn in place allows you to command the robot to move to a desired positive or negative angle. Now let's program the turn in place my block. I start by creating the commanded angle variable. The output of a gyro sensor block in measure angle mode is added to the commanded angle with a math block to calculate the end angle. A loop is added and a gyro sensor block in measure angle mode is added to measure the current robot angle. This is subtracted from the end angle with the output going into a math block in absolute value mode. A compare block checks if the robot is within 5 degrees of the end angle with the output as the input to a switch block in logic mode. If true, then a loop interrupt block causes the program to exit the loop to stop the turn. If false, then the program continues. A compare block checks if the commanded angle is greater than zero with its output as the input to a switch block in logic mode. The true case has a move steering block in on mode with steering 100 and power 10. The false case has a move steering block in on mode with steering 100 and power negative 10. A move steering block in off mode makes the robot stop at the end of the turn. To make the my block, I shrink down the program so I can select all of it. Then I select the My Block Builder tool, which opens its window. I name the My Block Simple Turn in Place and give it a turning icon. I add one input parameter and name it Command Angle. I give it a default value of 0 and a turn icon. Selecting Finish creates the My Block. I now connect the My Block input parameter to the Command Angle variable. Now, let's test it. I'll make a new program and drag in the simple turn in place my block. I'll tell it to turn 90 degrees. The gyro angle is shown in port 2 of the port view. Here it goes. It turns to the commanded angle. Now I'll tell it to move in negative 90 degrees. It turns to the negative commanded angle. Now I'll add a move steering block with a one wheel rotation drive and another simple turn in place my block to 90 degrees. This shows that the my block can be conveniently used multiple times in a program. Thank you for watching my video on simple turn in place. If you liked it, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Make sure to click on the bell to get notified every time we post a new video. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye!